Hello guys, hello Philippines, hello world. Okay, let's go back to business. <laughs> okay, uh, I will be able to, uh, once again, I will be able to introduce my uh, YT channel first. This is I am a singer, eternal voice. So I'm going to plug my next vlogging, okay, or live streaming. It's all about uh, collective properties okay so anybody knows about colligative properties so when you speak about colligative properties okay our solution does not depend on the nature of the solute okay it depends on the number of particles or it is dependent on the number of particles example like an ions or molecules okay of the solute in a given amount of solvent in an ideal solution something like that so what are those four examples of colligative properties okay we have the vapor pressure lowering okay an example for this is the routes law okay meaning if we introduce a non-volatile solute okay the vapor pressure of the solution <laughs> will decrease okay and second we have the boiling point elevation okay number three we have the freezing point depression and letter d we have the osmosis or osmotic pressure okay so in the boiling point elevation <laughs> okay we need to account the molality okay the molality of the uh, solute okay like that Okay, and then for the freezing point depression also, we need to determine the molality of the solute again. Both are using the constants, okay? For the boiling point elevation, we use the boiling point elevation constant, okay? And then for the freezing point, <laughs> freezing point depression uh, constant, okay? K. Okay, K, K, F for freezing point and K, B for boiling point elevation constant. So both are constants. Okay. What that one? Elioboscopic constant. I don't know for the boiling point elevation constant. It's also known as elioboscopic. <laughs> I don't know really. And then the constant of cryoscopic constant. Elioboscopic constant for the boiling point elevation constant the same name or the same term okay the same terms and then cryoscopic for the uh, freezing point depression constant okay like that that's on the same most terms okay <laughs> this is really on the spot <laughs> i'm just plugging it out okay, what i'm gonna going to do this uh, when i got home something like that when I come home, when I come home, okay, so that's collective properties, okay, thank you so much, and uh, I hope you guys will watch my uh, vlogging about that topic, that topic, collective properties have four sub-topics, okay, like that, okay, and then each subtopic have each formula also and we don't need to discuss Ryle's law because we already have problem solving for that right and then we will go to the uh, freezing point depression boiling point elevation and for the osmotic pressures osmosis so one by one we will be able to have an examples for that or problems for that to solve and then we will be able to introduce also each formula for that okay and then how to derive in that formula okay like that and we need to analyze okay and of course we need to memorize each formula for those colligative properties okay thank you so much for listening to me this is i am a singer eternal voice okay if you want to like comment subscribe then do it okay and just click the notification bell for our newest update of I am a singer, eternal voice. Hello, babush. Bye-bye, everybody. Thank you so much. God bless.